Hello students, my name is Priyanka and I am your digital mentor. Today I am here to start with the chapter 13 that is the power of knowledge. So let's kick start. Which language are the children using to communicate with each other? Early humans were aware of many things but they could pass their knowledge orally only. Later they felt the need of recording knowledge. So they developed the art of making signs and symbols by drawing, painting and writing. The development of writing. The Mesopotamian writing system is believed to be the oldest. Clay tokens with designs have been found, which may have been used for counting animals or quality of grains. These clay tables later evolved into depicting pictures of inscriptions. Language was a product of an agricultural society when humans began growing food and started leading a settled life. The world's oldest known alphabet appears to have been used in Egypt. The letters of the alphabet are basically symbols to which different sounds have been added. The first Indian script developed in the Indus Valley around 1600 BC. It is still undeciphered. Later Indian scripts like Brahmi and Kharoshti developed which enabled us to learn about the literature, mythology and history of ancient India. Over 200 modern Indian scripts are based on the Brahmi script. The oldest evidence of the Brahmi script belong to around 4 century BC. The story of numbers. The main occupation of the early man was hunting. The early man must have drawn the pictures of animals on the walls of cave of stones and put dots and dashes against it to indicate numbers. Indians were the first to use fingers for counting. The numerals that we use today are called Arabic numerals because it was from the Arabs that these <coughs> numerals spread to Europe. Actually those numbers were Indian in origin and should rightly be called Indian numerals. The Arabs adopted the Indian numerals and called these numbers Hinsa which means India. Development of paper. The development of paper was a great breakthrough of the spread of knowledge. The Egyptians were the first to use paper. Their paper was made of thin reeds that grew in the Nile Delta. This paper was called papyrus. It was a thick paper like material produced with the pitch of the papyrus plant. Egyptians used the plant not only as writing materials but also for using boats, mats, ropes, mattresses and baskets. For about 2500 years, paper made from the papyrus reeds was the only writing material available. Today paper is made from wood pulp, plant fiber and old rags. Printing press in ancient times, seals consisted of a raised or carved design in stones and were used for making impressions. China developed the art of printing in the 2nd century CE. They used wood blocks for printing. Over the years, various new techniques developed. The modern printing method was invented in German by John S. Gutenberg. John S. Gutenberg in mid 15th century used movable metal type for printing. This invention brought dramatic change in the field of printing. Today we see beautiful and colorful books just because of paper and printing. Advanced methods of printing have been developed. Today computers are used for all the major process of printing which help to produce a large number of books in less time. Braille script. Braille script enables the blind and partially sighted people to read and write through touch. It was invented by Louis Braille, 1809 to 1852, 
who was blind and became a teacher of the blind. It consists of patterns of raised dots arranged in cells of up to six dots arranged in a matrix of dot. Each cell represents a letter, a numeral of a punctuation mark. The blind person can easily feel these dots with the help of his fingers. There are many books written specially for the blind people. Today, audiobooks called talking books are also available for the blind students. So students, it's time to looking back. The Mesopotamian writing system is believed to be the oldest. Indian scripts like Brahmi and Kharoshthi developed which enabled us to learn about the literature, mythology and history of ancient India. The Arabs adopted the Indian numerals and called these numbers Hinsa, which means India. The development of paper was a great breakthrough in the spread of knowledge. The modern printing, sorry, the modern printing method was invented in German by Johannes Gutenberg. Braille script enables the blind and partially sighted people to read and write through touch. Audio books called talking books are also available for the blind students. So students, it's time to take your leave. We'll meet in the next class. Bye.